Yo guys, what's up? King K Pop with a K Pop review. It's definitely been a minute since I made my last uh, video. It's been about probably about, according to YouTube, I think it's been like a month, but I think it's been longer than that. Um, just been really, really busy on some stuff. Um, I know I've been my channel's been a bit neglected a little bit, but um, I'm back on track. Um, I'm gonna try to make some more videos. This one here in particular is on um, my review of Twice. Um, JYP's newest girl group. Um, to me, I have to say twice out of all the rookies that have, that have debuted in 2014 or 2015, um, twice to me has my vote for the best rookie debut. Um, I enjoyed their debut even more so than Icons, and Icons has always looked lackluster in my opinion, um, even with all three of their songs. This was a solid debut. Um, a little bit uns unsuspected, at least for me. Um, I knew originally JYP was going to release, uh, you know, the girl group, which the name was dubbed as uh, Six Mix. Um, so I, I assumed it was going to be six members. Then he did the show um, 16. And I never watched the show 16 because that came, that show came about shortly after Mix and Match. And after Mix and Match, I was just kind of a little bit done with the, uh, you know, group reality um kind of like shows that they were doing so i really didn't follow that show 16 or watch it so i, I don't know the members didn't know how many members were going to be in the group but long story short it's nine uh a nine member girl group uh again kind of like day six how day six are like a rock band and even got seven how they're jyp's first hip-hop boy band um a nine member girl group again another first for jyp and he's killing it with these new rookies and their new concepts um, and, you know, just just being different. Um, I guess JYP figured if YG Entertainment, if Young Huck Sook um, failed to do his, uh, you know, hip hop version of Girls Generation, since that didn't go too well, I guess you figure, well, I'll take on the, you know, nine girl member concept uh, thing and run with it. And it works. Um Twice his debut song. It's really, really catchy. It's fun. It's fresh. It really reminds me of um, K pop songs back in 2008 ish, um, 2008, 2009, where the girl groups were just kind of slaying it um, throughout the year. It really brought me back to the, and even the, the music even kind of reminded me of the music style back then, back in 08 and 09 um, in K pop. Um, I love the concept. The concept is fresh. It's original. Um, I don't know if I say original. I mean, there are a lot of K-pop videos with zombies, but it's fresh because you don't see it often. It's a very interesting concept. Um, they're like in a, a zombie apocalypse. Everyone are zombies, and um, even the, the the video itself. The video, um, if you compare it with the lyrics and what they're saying lyrically throughout the song, it doesn't really match. But it's it's okay because uh, I just enjoyed everything about this group um like i said the video was very fun uh, it was an interesting concept how everyone was like zombies but they weren't really um they kind of survived the zombie apocalypse um they even had a little bit of personality a little bit um you know one was kind of like a hip hip hopster another one was kind of like clumsy and goofy um another member was kind of like cutesy i guess like princey and prancy another one was kind of like athletic so they each had all their little own little personalities which i thought was very charming um, and even the lyrics of the song, the lyrics I thought were really, were really cute. It kind of reminded me of like a got sevens version of girls, 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 how got seven was kind of like bragging on themselves. How all the girls want them and they're the shit. Um, they kind of bragged a little bit in this song too. If you listen to the lyrics and if, especially if you read the translations, um, they kind of bragged a little bit on themselves as well. Um, you know, they want love, they want to find love and everything else, but you know, they kind of. They're kind of riding on cloud nine themselves. And I thought that was pretty interesting as well. The, ly the lyrical content, they're kind of bragging a little bit about themselves. Again, something different for a girl group um, or that you don't see very often from girl groups. Um, so I love Twice. I love the music video. It's fun. It's colorful. I love the concept. It's different. Um, I love the little nine members, little personalities, how they're all different from each other. The song itself is catchy as hell. Probably one of the more catchier songs I've heard this year. Um, and I think we've had some pretty good tracks, some good songs this year. 
but this is definitely stands out to me as one of the more catchy ones. And to me, I don't know, just something about this girl group and the song and the way everything about it, it just kind of threw me back in time in K-pop to that girl's generation first era or Wonder Girls when they first debuted. It really threw me back to that era, back to that time. And I guess that's the one thing I'm really enjoying about this group and their debut is the is that nostalgic feeling that I felt with, you know, the second generation K-pop stars when they first debuted. Um and and even a little bit in the early 2000s as well for the first generation. It kind of reminded me a little bit of the first generation K-pop stars as well. Um, some things. So I loved it. Love JYP. Um, JYP Entertainment is killing it this year. I'm probably going to make a video about this, uh, JYP in particular. But I love the song, love the video, and the group. Definitely looking forward to them, um, their live performance. What do you guys think of Twice and their debut song? Let me your thoughts in the box below. Comment, subscribe. Peace.